like to give a shout out to executive producer Bjorn Peterson for sponsoring this reaction. Thank you very much for your sponsorship. We absolutely appreciate it. Hey, welcome back to another EP sponsor reaction. This one's for Cobra Cat. Season 3, episode number 1. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell as well. I see you over there. Don't forget to like and subscribe either. Thank you for coming back for another round. Let's get it. Uh, shout out to executive producer Bjorn for sponsoring this reaction. Bjorn was so cool. He asked me what I wanted to be sponsored, and I was like, give me that Cobra Kai season 3 episode 1, because I gotta figure out what happened to Miguel. Yeah. So, appreciate you. Alright, Bjorn comes through to say, hey guys, this finale was awesome to mm -hmm. say the least, and what a cliffhanger that was. Everyone is royally forked right now, except for, love the use of forked. Um, except for Crease. In regards to the fighting, it is obvious that all the actors and actresses really learned a lot up to this point. Yeah. I read somewhere that especially Robbie and Hawk, uh, Hawk's actors improved the most over the course of the show and you can clearly tell. Yeah. I love that they played the original song Cruel Summer at the beginning of the episode, kind of foreshadowing what's about to come. You guys were jamming out and I was thinking to myself, just wait and see. The slow paced cover at the end is by Carrie Kimmel, just in case you were wondering. Mm. This version is in my playlist ever since. Damn. The show has just been ramping up and I hope you can can can. can can continue with season three not too long after the season two finale well thanks to you we get to so yeah. we hope it gets voted yeah. in though um i for one cannot wait to continue with you guys great reaction as always and i'll see you in the next one um ashley comes through to say so glad that you love the season and especially this finale so much until i got to this episode cobra kai had been a fun escape type watch for me and most of this episode is just ridiculous level drama but then it twists so sharply into actual real life stakes yeah. with that shot of miguel that i still have a hard time watching it mm -hmm. took me a while to watch season three because i was scared about how things would play out i won't say more about that but it was so fun to hear your predictions for where the story goes in season three thanks ashley yeah other quick thoughts uh, one, I agree that the show did a great job depicting the parallel mentorships of Johnny to Miguel and Daniel to Robbie and how it can be more powerful to balance Cobra Kai with Miyagi-Do Mercy. Uh, two, love the Dimitri moment against Hawk, the uh, little kids fighting, and the Stingray appearance. And three, the music was great. Thanks, guys. Yeah, Thanks, awesome. Ashley. Great comment. Mm -hmm. um, and then the last comment is from Jeremy who says... Um, this was a great episode. The one-shot hallway fight scene was great. How insane it must have been to film that, for real. Yeah. Uh, the actors and stunt people ducking in and out of shots to switch places back and forth, plus being able to see how much everyone has improved with their fighting ability. I love the fight scene and thought uh, there were a lot of great and entertaining moments, but daring, I was also thinking, where are all the teachers? <laughs> yeah, they the kids. They're, yeah. They're like, uh-uh. Fucking come from um, kids. I ain't going out there. Is it going to be all right for an adult stingray to be beating up kids? I feel like that's a crime. Is Tori legit trying to kill Sam or disfigure her? That's a lot. Yeah, yeah. yeah she was going Yeah, to Tori seemed a little bit, uh, Yeah, over the top. Yeah, yeah. Doing the most. Yeah, she might need to see somebody. <laughs> yeah. Then the Miguel moment happened, and it was shocking. Although I had been worried with the fighting getting more and more extreme that someone was going to get badly hurt, but I was thinking it would be more like Sam getting her arm cut up and bruises and cracked ribs. Not Miguel landing spine first on a railing two floors down. I can't yeah. even. I can't even picture that. I think to Ashley Ashley's point, that's a scene I wouldn't want to see again. No. Like that yeah. was very difficult to watch. That was tough. Uh, the use of Cruel Summer was also great, and the ending really left you wondering what's going to happen next. With Crease winning, Daniel seemingly giving up karate. Johnny seemingly giving up everything, Miguel possibly dying or being severe, severely injured, Sam in the hospital, and even Allie Mill sending the friend request at the end of the episode, what's next? Great reaction. I'm glad you're both enjoying the show so much. I hope you don't have to wait too long for the next season. Also, I don't think any season of Cobra Kai ends up being bad. I feel like they're all great seasons. Well, great insight, because I know we have like two more. I think we have three and fours already. Out, I think. Okay. Um, side note, the actor who plays Stingray, Paul Walter Hauser, recently won a Golden Globe for a different show and made an appearance in AEW, the wrestling company we're fighting with my family's page now. Mm -hmm. uh, Soraya recently made her return to wrestling after her career-ending injury, where he, had, where he ended up being hit with a guitar by Jeff Jarrett 
and his Golden Globe was stolen, thought RJ might find that interesting. Right. I think that's great. Yeah, he did, did some time wrestling. Yeah. Right? Uh, yeah, great comments as always, guys. Yeah. Uh, Jeremy, thanks for the insight as per usual. For sure. And let's jump into season three right now. What? The baddest badass is the one who beats his opponent when he's at his strongest. That means no more cheating. No more fighting dirty. I wasn't taught the difference between mercy and mercy. How do you know? Oh, this is bad. My attention would be better than I ever was. Well, you can't get to my life in real life. But... You can balance that with everything you got going on. Balance is my thing. Something tells me there's a can of wax in my future. I mean, nothing I'd like more than to have another chance. Now who's a loser? You got it. But you got to try to do things my way. I'm sorry. I just dealing with some stuff at home. We have the space. Obviously, he can stay here. I'm proud of you. Glad you're part of this family. And cut. Put one of those hash browns at the end, you know, like hash brown team culture. Hash, hash brown. Send it to the end of it. You did me. Send it to the end I don't remember it. Oh. <laughs> There's your fight. You lost. The fight is only over when you say it is. <laughs> but you can put this Cobra Kai belongs to me. You want Cobra Kai? It's yours. Here we go. And this is where we left off it. And this is where we're starting. Aftermath. Perfect label for the first episode. Title, I mean. This is it, folks. The moment we've all been waiting for. Returning to defend his title from Cobra Kai Karate. Miguel Diaz. Get ready. Dream. It's karate time. It's karate time. Face each other. Bow. Face me. Bow. Oh, yeah. Because he's obviously in the coma right now. described as an all-out karate riot caught students and faculty off guard, sending shockwaves through the valley. We got enough to worry about these days. Now I gotta worry about karate gangs in the schools? I heard there's a karate gang <laughs> <tech> for all <laughs> <laughs> Karate gang on the age. Earlier today, students organized a peaceful gathering of prayer and song. We Oh, when's the last time you showered, Dodo? You smell like a piece of dog shit took a dump. <laughs> Change it back, bro. You had a bar. People want to watch the game. They don't give a shit about no weather report or some coma kid. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, uh. Oh, oh, ah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, you're out. I'm an amigo. Here you go, homie. Oops. <laughs> Johnny Lawrence. No. 
not leave me here without an explanation. I can't believe they have the gall to suspend Sam for two weeks. And when I tell the school board how incompetent they are, it's will uh, At least they expelled the girl who started all of that. Expelled the bitch named Shawshank. Calm down. Calm down. Uh, everyone is against us. In case you haven't noticed, the dealership is a ghost town. But it's not that bad. Yes, it is. Daniel, our name is Poison. Turns out, kicking the competition isn't a cute tagline when your karate student literally kicks the competition over a railing. Look, I'm sorry. It's just... Oh, now y'all feel embarrassed? I mean, because the wife already knew what had happened before y'all went in there. And y'all still got up and talked shit. You're so, funny. go ahead and feel embarrassed now. That look infected. Ugh. Mm, you're alright. Morning, Moon. You might need to just go ahead and burn that. Let's whole just foot. completely cut that thing out. Here. Drug at it, drug at it. Holy shit. Applebee's guy. What is it with you and shitty chain restaurants? You know, happy I was supposed to be happy. Wait a minute. Your son's the one that kicked that kid off that balcony. I guess the garbage doesn't fall far from the truck. Or he's nothing like me. He's a good kid. He's a fugitive. Yeah. And why are you sitting around here talking? Shouldn't you be out there looking for him? Robbie made a mistake. Shouldn't mean his life is over. Tell that to the kid he killed. Damn. Did Miguel kill? die? What do you mean kill? Something happened to Miguel? I am a doctor. But after two weeks in a coma, the coma usually wins. Oh, he's just being really negative. Yeah, he's just being annoying. Don't do that shit. Don't do that shit. John Doe? All right, thank you. Well, that was useless. Nothing at the hospitals? No, and the homeless shelters were a dead end, too, so... Hey, boss. Uh, Mrs. Boss. I got something on my computer you gotta see. And don't worry, it's not porn on this time. Uh, all right, look. All right. It's not I mean, porn on this time. Right, bring it again. Listen, you know I'm not his biggest fan, but he was the first one at our door when Sam got hurt, right? However bad he screwed up, he does care about this fan. Oh, by the way, I bought bagels. But you better haul ass, you're gonna be stuck with the shitty cranberry ones. I didn't even ask for them. I mean, who eats those? So at first I thought it was just a blip on the screen. But no. It's just clear as day. All right, what am I looking at here? It's a trading lot. I made a spreadsheet. Those numbers... They don't match up. Are you sure this is right? It's one thing I know, it's inventory. I worked at Fast Sales all summer. Inventory is everything. I mean, it's not like cars here, but, you know. What, is somebody stealing shit? Chicken fingers, shit? mozzarella sticks, onion rings, Russian dressing. Those little jalapenos. Okay, I get the gist, all right? So you're saying we're missing a... It's so crazy. Suffer so much trauma puts you in a coma. It's like you can't be awake right now. Yeah. Your body, you're doing too much. Yeah. That's so crazy, right? I hope you can hear me. Yeah. He can. Just remind him you're here. Talk about things he loves. 
No sé, Miggy. Creo que los Dodgers van a llegar a los playoffs, ¿eh? Aunque supongo que lo van a cagar, como siempre. I'll be playing Dylan's Pinecki no. music, I'll be playing all his jams, I'll be, you know, like, ugh. And then I'll be crying all the time, <laughs> you know, just stressed yeah, out. Up. Can I help you? Uh, yeah, I'm here to see Miguel Diaz. No, he's in the ICU. Are you family? Uh, no, but, uh... Only family, doctors and patients in the ICU. Okay, you make an exception? Those are the rules. And then you come in looking like this. Busted and stinky. <laughs> yeah, get out of here, bro. Break the rules. Come on, be a bad girl. Only family, doctors, and patients in the ICU. Uh, you're not fun. He could have easily just been like, I'm his cousin. So he came back to your house? For me and Johnny, there wouldn't have been a fight in the first place. This is my fault. That's also true. It's actually you and Johnny's fault. I, I will not take soul's money. Just we are. At least we try to be. That's what's most important. But there's one thing I do know for sure, and that's I can't run away from mine. But you've been doing forever. Far away. And possibly. We might need to keep him overnight. Lab found blood in his urine. He's gonna start waking up. Beeps and Jane. He yeah, did. They were beeping. In I mean, Jane. he's beeping this for him to be alive. So, unless he changes the do. No, it sounded like they were beeping faster when he was like doing the thing. But it's probably just me sticking out. Johnny here. Excited. You know, Johnny here. It's only me, Crease. Mm -hmm. 
worse than Johnny. What the hell? We're closed. The dojo's going through some renovation. You should stop leaving the door open. What do you think? Where's Johnny? He's not here right now. But he'll be back. He got weapons in there now. You know, it's a shame what happened at the school. Such a tragedy. Such a tragedy. But I don't really blame Robbie. Because you know what they say. There's no such thing as a bad student. Mm. That's what he said. Bad teacher. It must really hurt to see the Miyagi name dragged through the mud. Wish I could see the look on the little bastard's face. That no. little bastard kicked your ass. More than once. Yuck. He's asleep. I got a lead on Robbie. You wanna go get him? I've been trying to find him on my own. Like he my kid, but he not. But I thought maybe you'd like to help. It's like you wanna team up? Join the force? <laughs> Shut up! Calm down! They ain't even at that level. Yeah, All mean, we're doing is a rescue that's, mission yeah, right now. That's the beginning. Look at Robbie. But he's he's his hair. Hair. He doesn't have anyone to help. I got a doofus with that haircut, babe. He just look a little goofy, but that's okay. But he cut his hair himself. He just freaked out and like... Oh. The whole reason these yeah, kids... Get your ass up those stairs. One fight. One fight. Mercy. We can't let them... Bend that up, baby. I won't let it get affected. Alright, you coming back? The only way to end this is by working together. That's what we oh. said, babe. We're gonna have to work together. We gotta team up. What do you say? Join forces. The best Miyagi do, and the best of Cobra Kai. Miyagi Kai. <laughs> Miyagi Kai. <laughs> but you can't even use Kai, though, because you got it over here. Can you still kick though, bro? I mean, can you walk? Like, let's just get to walking <laughs> before we get to the karate bit. <laughs> can you kick though? <laughs> I'm like, what? I'm like, let's just... Can you get that leg? Can you up? stand up? <laughs> can you sit up for Can money? you do a flip? <laughs> <laughs> Babe was extra over here. I mean, ridiculous. Uh, can you kick a motherfucker through that spin thing? Like they did can you run and jump? Go! Go! <laughs> Cobra Cat, and as you can see, that was a lot of fun on there. Um, not too fun when it comes to uh, Miguel laying there, um, you know, not knowing if he was going to wake up out the, the, out the coma, but he did, and now his eyes work, but like Babe said, does your legs work? And so we'll find that out in the next coming episodes, and we'll see if he's ready to do some more Kung Fu, or if he's going to go ahead and take the back seat and retire. And so we'll see. I'm glad he woke up, though. Cause that Fight the coma, so to speak. And what Johnny said to Miguel ultimately got him motivated enough to, like, wake back up. It's just yeah. very sweet yeah, and endearing, yeah. and I really, really loved it. I also loved uh, Dan <clears throat> uh, Daniel as far as, like, getting a point finally. Because, honestly, I mean, I think I've been very consistent that Daniel's more annoying to me than Johnny's. Just for a millisecond, and you just hated him every second of that millisecond. You're just like, oh, I hate you. I can't wait till we take you out. Oh, yeah. I feel like sets a great tone for the season. So really <laughs> hyped about this episode. I thought it was a great pilot. I love the fact that it started right after where we left off. And I like that it is a jump off of them already potentially collaborating together. Yeah, yeah. So I think this is setting up for a really good season. And hope we get to get into the rest of the season more consistently soon. So vote it in. Yep. 
All right, well, look, thank you guys again for watching another EP sponsor reaction for Cobra Kai, season three, episode number one. And until next time, peace.